our journey starts here. Okay then, hi there! Aren't you on the systems team? Oh hi, yes I am! In fact, we've been waiting for you. Take your coffee and let's go! Oh thank you! Lead the way! Hey team! Hey! Hi! Is this the right time to ask you some questions? Sure, fasten your seatbelt and go ahead! What seatbelt? Wait a minute, how did this get here? Was it you? Okay then, well, uh, could you tell me who a systems engineer is? So a systems engineer is basically somebody who integrates multiple systems together. So for example, taking this into account, we have a LiDAR product and we have a vision product. These two subcomponents, we put them together and integrate it into one big package that we can, for example, call ADAS, which is semi-autonomous cars that we then put into our customers' vehicles. Can anybody tell me more about this? I can. You know what? For that, let's go up. Nice! What kind of sorcery is this? So this is our workspace and now Chris can tell you more about our responsibilities. Chris, could you please continue? Is this how your daily tasks look like? There's no such thing as an everyday for a systems engineer. What you can see here is something called the V-cycle. At the beginning of the project we get the customer requirements. Because of that you have this stage called a requirement stage. In this stage you look at what they gave you and you have to basically specify and redefine uh, so that it meets the, the actual needs the best. You then get into software integration. These guys integrate the software based on our requirements that we have written here. And then once they've done their job, we get a package that we can actually flash onto the vehicle and test. This is actually where you get your hands dirty as well. You have to test and verify your own feature and function as well. So that means traveling a lot, right? Of course. I need to be in Wuppertal soon. Thanks for the insight. Thank you, it was my pleasure. Guten Tag, Wuppertal. Bon dia, welcome to Wuppertal. There's so much we want to show you. Obviously, if you want to be a good system engineer, there's a few skills you have to have. But I'll introduce you to Ilchen, who can tell you more about them. Merhaba. Merhaba. What are the three most important skills of a systems engineer? Skill number one is, as you're a part of engineering world, you need to have a good technical background so that you can understand what are the customer expectations and what can be delivered with the current technology. What's skill number two? Oh, I can help you with that. Hi. Hi. As a function owner, you need to imagine and put yourself in the shoes of the end customer. You need to help to design, implement, and then test the software your team is delivering. That's fascinating. What's number three then? Oh, our team from Gothenburg can help you with that. Gothenburg, Sweden, here we come. Excuse me, am I in the right place? Hello, welcome to Gothenburg Technical Center. Hi, who do I have the pleasure of meeting? I'm Alexandra, I work as a systems engineer and me and my team are working to introduce Android to commercial vehicles. You and your team, so just these folks over here? No, it's more of us. Come with me. What makes a great systems engineer? It's all about communication, using your interpersonal skills to work together with the project management, the customer and the development teams to create the best products. Noted! This was an amazing lesson and journey. Thanks everyone, maybe we'll meet again. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.